Hey, come on, I wanna load you. Thank you. Hey there everyone, this is Alcal playing some Kirby 3! Let's just go ahead and 3 our Kirby here. World 2 of World 2, and let's see, what does Bird and Needle tell us? Oh my god! <laughs> Rampage! Wait, 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 I'm gonna need, however, Parasol for later, so... Might as well take it right now and play some golf! It's Birdie Golf, I guess! Oh man, I kinda wish I could still be using a... a come back, please, Pitch. Pitch! 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 Wow, this is not the greatest power. Well, I don't know, it can be very useful, but it's not as useful as Needle es Esperado there. Yeah, so depending on like how much you hold a button, the coconuts fall on your head and destroy your face. Yeah, you, you can control kind of like the, the strength by which you're hitting your friendly birdie around. Man, that's... That's how you know it's a real friend, when you can just knock him around all day long and he doesn't complain. He'll even destroy coconuts for you, it's, it's pretty great. Oh, I could use that, could use that. Hey, Mr. Guy, I could use that. How do you feel about that? Why, why are you insisting on existing? Come on, it's an insult. Can, can, oh yeah, and you can play golf underwater too. Bogies, oh, you can't slide though. And also, everything is very slow. Everything is very slow in Denmark. All the time, I guess I'm going to take the fish. Hey there, fish, how do you do? Now we're gonna play the game of life. Uh, it's very awkward. Uh, I don't know where Kirby is in this uh, in the, in this equation. He simply is. Uh, well, anyways, whoops. That's not what I want to do. Go, go, oh, well, go ahead and die. So now we're in a fish, so we can actually fight the currents, which I'm displaying by not fighting the currents at all. Also, I have, like, the worst weapon in the universe, so it's... Like, I kind of have to try an uppercut with my parasol here to fish, I guess. The lesson here is I should probably try and avoid them instead. That sounds to be like it would be a... Whoa, you see, now that I got a fish, I can go like, ho, 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 and go, ho, ho, ho. Oh, come on! Like, like I, I got a half... Can I destroy you? I want to destroy you, guy. How do I destroy... Oh, I guess I absolutely need to eat you, but... No! I need that! I need that! Uh, no! I needed that! I needed that! I needed that! <laughs> For once, I finally got destroyed by my complete inability of not being hit. Gooey, please let me absorb you into my body again. Oh man, that was quite a, a message. But okay, I, I need to find another parasol. Stats? You are fire, you're not parasol at all. Wow, that's pretty neato though. <laughs> Bursting into flames. I want to go down here. There's stars I can get and I can get more damage because I just cannot help but not get damage. No! See, I had to bring this guy a parasol! Can I set you on fire instead? It's gonna be like if I was cooking you! I'm sure as a jello you'd appreciate that! Aw oh, man! Aw oh, man and a half! Aw oh, man and a quarter and everything in between! Maybe there's something here... I don't know, I mean, like, there's a door here, I mean, surely a, a door can lead to... Well, there's Rick. I, I don't need Rick, and I don't need the owl, I need the fish and the parasol! Which I have neither in nor of. Ah! Destruction of all the wildlife here. So finally we are at... Well, I'm right at the end, too. Oh, man. Well, now, you see, this is actually all a super planned demo. See, I see that guy? He's so sad he's hiding behind a tree. I'm gonna burst some more out of fire! Ah, oh, freaking guy, look! This is... This is very, a very, very weird scene. I, um... Honestly, this kind of defies description. <laughs> Demo Theater. So, do I want useless umbrella tree? Uh... Hamster at the circus that I can't even move forward? Or... What does the owl give us? <laughs> Now that is hilarious. Well, regardless, dude there, he's finally happy enough to give us a medal and we can just Tasmanian our way into it. <laughs> Man, whoever said the owl was awesome was pretty much right, even though, wow, okay, so his reaction to being inconvenienced is to just kind of jump forward a little bit. So now we're gonna meet an eel inside an iceberg, which seems to be the logical deduction to make, so I'm quite happy to see you today. 
So hey, hello, this is a brand new day. There's a fish and there's a guy. He doesn't exist anymore. How about everybody? Well, no, I'm gonna destroy your boat because as an owl, I am completely oblivious to technology. Uh, it's true, like, ask your local owl at your zoo. Ask him about, like, uh, the iPad or something, and he's just gonna stare at you like you were talking about crazy things. Oh man, not even giant scary munchy things can tolerate the presence of a twirling owl. It's pretty great. Well, I don't want ball, and I don't want pointless, so you know what? Screw you two! You're both dumb, and I don't have a better power than Umbrella. Maybe it's the... I think I'd rather have, actually, thunder power than, uh... Crazy Betty, then and then you know the lightning. No, I, I want the lightning. That's that's the purpose. Well, I, why would I would I why would I want to go through all that risk? Oh my God, I'm like electrocuting the whole world there. No, actually that's not what happens. I thought it was what was happening, but no, that wasn't what was happening at all. I can't get the life. Well, that's discrimination because I do not have a crescent in my little square. Man, you're quite a swimmer though, Mr. Owl. It's pretty neato. Uh, we're now underground. There's oh, I love the water effect. That is neat, guy. How did you manage to get there? It's bonus time. Gotta. I, okay. Hello there, Yuzagi. How's it going, buddy? Ill. So what's going on here? Oh no, it's a uh, switch and bait. I'm. I'm very poor at these. I know you were here. So there's number one. Oh man. Uh. Come on, you barely, like, take your head out there. That's silly. Okay, gotta pay attention. I think you were in the middle again. Wow, uh, dude, you... That wasn't very effortful of you to just kind of go in the middle all the time. I was just expecting some granular dreams of sorrow and mustard gas here, but no, you just went in the middle all the time. I mean, I shouldn't complain because this could have potentially... Gone, gone airy, airy, or area of effect, and uh, that's not something we should tolerate in our world. So, uh, it looks like I got myself a bum deal for this world, you know? Ha, ha, well, well, let's see. Owl and fire, what what does that give Grant us? Holy bananas! Comet Crush! <laughs> no auto scrolling does not scare me in the slightest. Oh man, that is awesome. Meteor Strike he even works on the water for some reason. Oh man, Fire has all the best effects, and an owl is pretty cool. So put those two together, and you get well. I mean, cool and and, pre and hot makes like tepid, but I guess we'll we'll tolerate that. I still got all my health, so I can just go here and like comet crash through a shark. No, I can't. I can't crash to a shark. I've always wanted to burst through a shark, and then finally Kirby 3 gives me a room for my dream. My child shark it just kind of exploded there. So, uh, we're on water. It's pretty right. You know, we got seaweed just kind of dancing around to the music. It's pretty right. We probably want to go up there. That's pretty right. And yeah, there's the end. But there's some boxes. What about the boxes, man? Well, if we got the boxes, we get some stars. This is how it works. There's like a big old star on the box. That's how you know what is inside. Hooray! Man, this power makes me happy. Oh, hey there, Mr. Eel. Are you gonna give me my prize? And you just get ahead and gave it to me as I said it. I love, like, that abstract construction there. It's very neato looking. I like it a lot. Got the islands over there, down there. I guess that's where we used to be. I do not know. Let's jump for... I always get a black thing. I just cannot resist the alluring smile of a black circle. And I guess next time we're gonna go over to the... Wow, look at that frog. <laughs> yeah, looks like that's nice. next time we're gonna go to the big giant asparagus. It's just kind of jutting out of the water. The waters are pretty scary. You don't want to eat anything that comes out of water. Because I mean, water, after all, is the symbol of death. Basically, just try to avoid anything resembling water and you'll be fine. You can totally trust me on that. I am a professional... Water phobicologist. With that said, see y'all. I guess. Yay!